I definitely was not always as confident as I am today. And I'm, there are many days I still don't feel confident. It's interesting, as a child, I was painfully shy, painfully shy. I would hide behind my mother and my brother all the time. Uh, and it wasn't until I got later into my school years that I realized the importance of having a voice and having a perspective and getting outside of my comfort zone to share my opinion. I remember early at Oracle in my career being in meetings and I'd be too afraid to say something, maybe because the people around me were, were all men or perhaps it was because they were more senior. and. Then the person next to me would say the thing that I'd been thinking about for 10 minutes and I would just cringe and they'd be like, great comment, Bill. And I'm like, I thought of that 10 minutes ago. Why didn't I say that? Uh, so it was really just kind of getting frustrated with myself and the fact that I wasn't speaking up that encouraged me to be um, more open in my thoughts and sharing my perspective. And, and also I'm a big believer when it comes to public speaking uh, or interviews or whatever uh, your personal challenge is, it's really, it's about practice and getting exposure. Sometimes the things that we fear, we don't wanna do them and that doesn't help us. It's, it's getting out there, it's doing it and you absolutely get better. With, with time and suddenly that used, something that used to be very terrifying becomes second nature.